Welcome, welcome, welcome back, guys. Um, today I have just a, a little bit of the sheen haul. And I thought maybe we would do my nails, but I'm not sure yet we're going to do that, but I do have a haul here. Um, Shein, so let's see what we got. Snake pig hair. This is not nail related, but isn't it adorable? It is a shoe ass little hair tie scrunchie. Bro, what? <laughs> adorable. Yes. <laughs> I don't have it. Okay, the next thing here. A nail tool, of course. Gotta have a nail tool. This is a uh, silicone, like, just a silicone, like, spatula thing. As you can see. Don't mind my nails, they are awful. bad they are in recovery as we speak so i'm gonna cover those up so you guys ain't looking at my nails all the time all right so yeah you can use this for like chrome powder when you're like rubbing the chrome on love it has a cap cool then i got these little leafs Aren't they adorable, guys? What? 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 They are stinking cute. You can see them in the package here. I'm not really going to take them out because you can see what they are. Different sizes, different colors, green and white. Cute. Then I got a couple rings for photographs. Absolutely love this one. Adorable. Goes this way, really. So, yeah. Those are cute. And a, another one. Adorable, you guys. These would be great for photos. Photos. And last but least, I went ahead and picked up a cat eye polish. Look at that, guys. Look at that. It works phenomenal. Phenomenally. As I should say, look at that. It's very good quality, you guys. This is the brand. I went ahead and swatched it already prior to the video, so make it a little easier. But it's like a diamond cat eye. Gorgeous color, guys. Highly, highly recommend this. Look how well that came out. Adorable. So, that being said... Let's get some nails on. Okay, guys. So, I think I have everything here I need. <laughs> Let's hope. So, I think I'm going to use these Beatles tips. They are a white, like, white coffin shape. 
And I love the shades, so I'm going to use these. I'm going to go ahead and size these out to my fingers. Sidewall to sidewall. And then, I shall retain my views. Alrighty, so I'm just going to do one hand with you guys. So, to prepare my nails, I'm going to push back my cuticles. Very gently, you guys. Gentle, gentle on everything you do to Don't your natural nail plate. Be very gentle to it. Obviously, I haven't been minor all tore up, you guys. So do not judge on the nail plates, please. Now my nails are off the hook, tore up. That's why I'm trying to cover my mouth. So, I've been taking some more vitamins and stuff, so my nails are just going out a lot stronger. They are coming back a lot healthier. I'm just letting the bad part grow out of my nails, so. Sidewalls got chipped off and everything. Yes, yeah, not good. Not good, guys. No, gotta watch. So, with this, I'm going to clean don't off my plate with some um, McCart surface cleaner here and a lint free uh, nail wipe. Just like so. Just clean them off so there's no oils on there. Staring at herself in the mirror on the restroom door. And you can come in with your dehydrator and primer if you wish. All the things they said to hold her back, they never seem to leave her and tend to keep her mind at war. All the things they said to hold her back, they keep her locked inside of all the times when she's been hurt. Yeah. And they do hide for a second. Her eyes are swollen as she tries to hold her tears back. Nice and white. Okay, so when that's all, I'm not gonna put no primer. I am going to come in with a strong gel in the I purchased this on Amazon, guys. You guys can find it there. I uh, will try to leave a link in the description box for you guys. Put a layer of this on your nail plate. And cure it for 60 seconds. Alright guys, uh, now I'm going to come in with this. If you'd like to prime the inside of these tips, you could, but I'm really not going to do all that. You know, kind of get a little bit of this glue stuff out of here. Kind of like so. Grab my little silicone tool here and just try to smush it down a bit. Place it on the nail, smush it down. Go, perfect. Cure it. 60 seconds. Love the shape of these tips, you guys. They are perfect. Love them. So I'm going to continue that process with all of them, guys. I'm just going to put a dab in there and then squish it on the nail here. Nuke it, and I'll be back. Okay, I cleaned up around the cuticle areas. Let's clean them off a bit here. They are looking good. Oh, 
love them. <coughs> Pardon me, guys. So sorry. I was thinking about these sunflowers. I'm just I got this beautiful yellow color here from Neil. I'm just spending all my thoughts on you. Sure, God. What to do? I'm going to clean up the three edges. The nails really quick. Mary Jane, please hurt me. Mary Jane, please take me. Mary Jane, decide and we shall return. Thanks for being here. Much love. Appreciate each and every one of you. You rock. Thanks. And don't forget that like button, guys, on the way out. It helps me out a lot. And drop me a comment, guys. And yeah, subscribe if you are new and like this kind of content. Consider joining our little nail group here. I am a DIYer. I am not a nail license tech yet. But anything I learn, I like to share. So. If you're a DIY enthusiast, join our little club here. Love to have you. I think we're just gonna win it, you guys, today. And you have to see what happens. I want to use some of these soils. Not sure how many of the hearts or the stars yet. Hmm. Don't know. We'll wing it. Let's just get into it. I have a bunch of gems. I also have my collection of, um... Beautiful jelly things to use here. There's some in jelly. Molding things. So. <coughs> with that being said, should I put a base coat on first? Or should I just come on in with the polish? I think I will put a base coat on. Because these are kind of like shiny. So. Let's apply thin layer of this base gel. But if I stop moving, okay, then I'll have understand. to face myself. I don't want to face myself. Try your very best not to get it on your skin, you guys. I don't want to face myself. I'm going to go ahead and do that really quick. Get the hair out of here if I can. I never finish well. what I'm starting. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this base coat to all of them really fast to you guys. Dry. Nuke them for 60 seconds. And I'll be right back. Alrighty guys. Bada boom, 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 bang, boom. Okay, so now we have all that on. Take that one away. <laughs> okay, so what are we going to do, you got? Uh, mm, excuse me. <laughs> Pardon me, guys. That was rude. I have this beautiful, like, creamy baby yellow. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh, stunning color. Spring. Perfect color for spring, guys. You know, I think I will put some of that on here. Yeah. 
you know, I got a little cleaner upper brush here. My vanity. Gorgeous. So, touch it up. Get horror 60 seconds, you guys. I'm gonna get into the arc. Gorgeous, aren't they? Stunning. So, I'm going to apply um, cream on one of them and see what it looks like. The glossy. I'm getting a white top coat here. Hmm. Well, you know. Forgiving guys, it will show every little hair or nookie or any little thing that you did wrong. It will show it. Try to not get any bumpies or anything in your nail, top coat or anything, you know, so it's nice and smooth application. Top off the bottom. Nuke that for 60 seconds. I think I'm gonna go ahead and put it on all of them. Now I'm just rubbing on the chrome powder using my tool here. Just makes it a little easier to rub in. Just dip it in the powder. Dip it on in. Rub it on, guys. I think we're very cute. So far, so good. So I'm gonna close that up so I don't spill it. Then just take yourself a little duster and dust them off a little. Good job. Can you see the chrome effect? I hope. Yes. Gorgeous. So I have cut out these little patches of these. Well, really. Give that a little nookaroo. Give that a little minute nuke. I'll be right back, guys. Hey, guys. So they're out. Alrighty, so, anyway, <laughs> uh, so we're going to apply these. like so, pat pat, and rub it on there. Alright, guys. Voila! Balloon. Okay, we'll move on to this one. This 
kind of the same thing, just the opposite way. Rub, rub. Soon you'll see it just release right off. Voila! Okay, and last but least, this one here. Middle layer, I might be able to just use this one piece. So I'll be right back, guys. To check. Okay, I think that's good, guys. Looking adorbs. Loving it. So now you can come in and go ahead and top these off. Another top coat if you'd like. Just to seal in the what you have done so far, or you can continue like I'm about to. So I have these little like I don't know what they're called, but they look like a little horse eye. <laughs> I was thinking of making a flower with these. So what I'm gonna do is apply. All that off. Wonder if I got a plan for everyone. Okay, now coming in with Wonder these. Wonder if I could take a second run. Cause I'll carry on getting sad and getting stuck. Mm. What I wouldn't give for a life that doesn't suck. I'm a moving target. I never finish what I've started. Mm. But if I stop moving, then I'll have to face myself. I don't want to face myself. I don't want to face myself. Maybe I'll just put them down the line. And I'm up. I don't want to face so. myself. I'm a moving you know, target. It's not covering up that pretty little star I design. I like the same match. I like so. I like it, so I'm going to neutralize this place. One more up here. There we go. Get those, I'll be right back to show you what I did. I'm going to go ahead and finish this set off really quick, guys. I'm going to add a little bit of bedazzle dazzle on here, and I will be back to show you the final shots. So stay tuned, beauties. All right, guys, you ready? Ready for it? Voila! Aren't they adorable, guys? They came out stinking cute. I like them. So, yeah, they came out adorable, guys. Adorable. Let me know what you guys think. Drop me a comment. Drop your girl a comment. Till I talk at you guys again. Toodaloo, guys.